What's Capri all about? Let me just say to you, I think this think tank is enormously important. I think Capri is a brilliant idea and a really exciting new player here in the Asia Pacific region. Capri is a nonprofit, nonpartisan, independent research organization focused on enhancing global resilience, promoting innovative governance, drawing from the experiences of the Asia Pacific. Capri is the really the first think tank of its kind focusing on public policy, not just here in Taiwan, but throughout the region. We are living in an age where the pace and scale of change is greater than ever. I find that uh, the Asian voice is actually a minority voice because there are very few people speaking out for Asia. The diversity of the area is both its biggest challenge but also its possibly its biggest richness. That diversity will also provide many different ways of attacking a problem. We're dealing with so much change all the time. And so we have to be resilient. Well, resilience is really the capacity to absorb, adapt, and learn from it. Uh, and of course, this is not just about resilience in health systems. It's, it's the interrelatedness of the resilience of society, of the economy. And of course, this is not just about to, to threats, but also to ongoing uh, challenges that each system is facing. So resilience is about adapting, and it's a continuous process. In many cases, simply recovering is not resilience. We should be able to recover fast and in a way that we're not going back to the same old state as before. We learn from the past as we think about the future. We're facing new problems as a world. We need new thoughts and new ideas. Well, here in Asia, innovation is a byword because everyone is innovating and the whole world is looking at Asia because of its innovations. We survive on globalization. We cannot afford to go back. We can only move forward and look forward. And that is why Capri has come at a time in a place where I think uh, the world pivots towards again. There isn't a think tank tradition in Asia. I think Capri is a really important institution in this regard because we don't actually share enough of our experiences and our ideas in this region. Every country uh, is seeking to deal with the same challenges or similar challenges and we're all approaching them in different ways. So it's important to share that experience and learn from it. I wish that Capri can continue growing and I uh, would like to see that this will be the global, not only regional. Institutes like Capri will give us the opportunity to develop some commonalities uh, among us. So Capri can become a, like an honest broker between the public sector, not just in one particular country, but right around the region, and between the private sector and academia as well. Capri's core purpose is to educate the public and policymakers, stimulating discussion on some of the most pressing issues facing the world today, breaking down silos of thought to produce practical, actionable policy recommendations. My expectation is that Capri will continue from a very promising start to become a major force for good public policy in our region. Yeah, let's uh, work together more and uh, try to really build Capri into a reliable and reputable institution going forward.